Hey guys, it's a cold one today. December 23rd, decided to take my bike down for a joy ride. I don't think I showed this bike on this channel before. This is a 1975 Schwinn Collegiate that I bought in the summertime. I don't ride it much because it's just so beautiful, but I decided, hey, you bought a bike, you need to you need to ride it. It's like buying a new pair of shoes, Jordans that you don't want to wear because you don't want to crease them up, but no, you buy it to use, right? So, and it is a fun ride, super fun. And anytime I ride it, I always have like just a great time. So thought I'd show it today. 1975 Schwinn Collegiate. This bike is one year older than me. How about that? We're down on the Harrisburg waterfront near the bridges and uh, just a gorgeous area. This is my area. It's my home. So uh, I enjoy it. I like it. I like it a lot and a good place to be a cyclist, I think. I've shown this area before, but um, it's my home base, so you're going to see it. <laughs> if you watch my channel, you're going to see it. It is a cold day, it's about 35 degrees, but it's still beautiful out here, as long as you dress for it. It's even more beautiful when you're riding a fine piece of American machinery like this, made in Chicago, Illinois. You would think a bike like this, 48 years old, wouldn't ride smoothly, but it rides so freaking smooth. It's unbelievable how smooth this bike rides. I don't think they don't make them like they used to. These steel frame bikes are just beautiful.
Speaking of beautiful, that is the Susquehanna River here on my left. We are again in Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, which is the capital of Pennsylvania, if you didn't know. Most people think it's Pennsylvania, uh, Philadelphia. Damn, wrong. Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. Look at the architecture, it's really nice. I know Harrisburg's got a bad name because, you know, maybe there's parts of the inner city that's not as nice. Uh, again, I, I said this before, but I've never been in there, so I don't know. To me, Harrisburg is nice. I don't know any, nothing's ever happened to me. It looks good. I don't see anything not good. I'm sure there's parts, but I, I don't know. I just don't know those parts. I'm not out here like cycling, like cycling, cycling with, like, with my main bike. I'm just cruising, I'm joyriding since I'm on a, bike that's so old like this 1975 bike I don't think you can go that long I don't know I could probably do 20 miles or so but eh. just cruise this is what I do with this bike I just cruise cool man a lot of cool houses around here again I'm just joy riding I wanted to show off the bike. I guess I'm showing my face too much, right? <laughs> but really, I just wanted to say uh, have a happy Christmas and New Year if I don't m upload another video. I appreciate everyone who followed me from Japan to Pennsylvania this year. I, I don't know why you would continue to watch, but <laughs> that's a big jump. It's a big difference. But thank you so much. 2024, we'll do more adventures, not just in Pennsylvania, but in the surrounding areas. I hope to get to New York and West Virginia and Virginia and Maryland possibly soon I'll be in Maryland so we'll see we'll see what 2024 brings hopefully health and wealth but most of all health have a Merry Christmas a Happy New Year from Rock Eastwood and my wife back in Japan and uh yeah as always thank you so much I really really appreciate you taking the time with all the things to watch Netflix and HBO and stuff you're clicking on my video and that I thank you very much.